Hello people on the internet. In this video I will be shooting two rolls of film. Can the two man? Well originally I was going to shoot one, but you will see why. Cine Steel 800 t I've been holding this film for a year now. It's 21 Canadian dollar per roll and been out of stock for a long time. Well tonight is the night to expose it. I'm quite nervous to be honest. I never used the Cine Steel before, don't know what to expect, and I never did film night photography before. Okay, finger crossed. I double check, even triple check to see if the film back is securely locked. The last thing I want is having it fail off during shooting and it drops on and hits an end, the end that's supposed to capture the defenseless caterpillar across the street under the dandelion before the caterpillar becomes a butterfly and flops its wing too many times to cause a tsunami in Chile 14 years later.这些啥都看不见 好吧,拍一张 I was so dumb here. I forgot this camera is not going to auto close its shutter. My Pentax K1000 will open its shutter as long as I'm pressing the shutter button and close the shutter when I release the shutter button, but not this camera. In order to close the shutter from bulb mode or T mode for this camera, I have to crank the shutter again or move its aperture ring. So the exposure time I got for this first shot is actually around 9 seconds.然后五秒钟之后我就调一下aperture，然后就OK了。当然不能有光的力。OK，second Okay,那去下一个地点去。要拍远景哦。全身拍到吗?有吗?有。看着。
这个地方。我们现在要去这个地方。我看看在什么地方。When I'm out about, I take photos with my phone. When I see something I want to capture in film, let the GPS in my phone mark the location. It's really convenient. Here, to give five minutes of light is almost impossible because the cars are too many. I suddenly feel that filming this could be at night. Here, I am filming one photo. To one minute. 嗯、Shooting film is a very slow process for me. It can take me months to finish one roll, especially with a cumbersome camera like this. I'm not bringing it with me everywhere like the Pentax K1000 I used to bring with me every day. Also, I'm not going out as much this year due to COVID. Anyway, it's been almost a month between fourth shot and fifth shot. This is my new friend Ian. He is a photography and a film graduate student. And that was the fifth exposure. Sixth exposure was taken a week later. Ian is with me again. I think two of them. Two. So the ten dollar membership. This comes free. Twenty five off. Ten off. Ten. 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 And ten percent off. Number four. Okay. I'm going to show you the ISO 5000 now. It's very slow to get the door to the door. It's a little difficult. Do you want to go to the front? No, I'm afraid. I thought we were going to go around and around the city. But I don't have time. I'm going to take it. Yeah, we're supposed to walk around the city before it's this dark. I did have a gorilla pod that I used for vlog camera. It's now my emergency photography tripod. This is a little bit of an outsider. 我喜欢这个构图。When I'm editing, I can't help but appreciate how sturdy Ian holds the camera, especially comparing with my wife. Okay,一片黑吗？我还就这样子，正常正常。现在要测光是吧？嗯，这构图已经OK了是吧？我看一下，我看。哦，你决定就行。这个完全归你，你玩的。我的相机最少是三点五，所以你最最最最快的速度就
。嗯，然后呢？三点五，三点五会不会太 shallow？ 二分之一的。五点六八有没有？五点六行不行？二分之一的话是五点五。五五点五是吧？五。那这里只能到五点六，那我到一去吧。那五没有没有五。二和五点六是吧？没关系，你决定看效果。哦，五点六嘛，去一吧。一哦 ，OK， 好。哦，拉到底。放好放。现在显示什么？好暗哦。十，十 ，OK， 最后一张。有点冷了。这个树的我觉得挺合适的，这样。对，怎么样？树怎么树？底下的这个转一下，应该是往，往往往往右转。不用不用不用，直接往右转。啊、对 ，OK 了。现在树够多。哦，这里光线不错。等一下，我我我偷个桌子过来。会不会被 kick out？ 测可以了，测光，但正好，聚焦都聚好了。对，看一眼，应该路过吧。哦。啊，糊的不得了，不一定能看到呢。没了，对吧？嗯，搬搬搬，一路搬到底。搬再搬。对，一直搬一直搬，直到没有阻力了。对，点进去了。我们得把桌子点进去。把它贴进去。希望我洗它的时候不要翻车。谢谢。I immerse developer and bleach bottle into warm water to around 39 degrees Celsius. One minute pre-soaking warm water. Three minutes and a half for developer with agitation for every 30 seconds. Six minutes and a half for bleaks with agitation every 30 seconds. Rinse with water for three minutes. Film can be exposed under light at this step. So I usually check whether I messed up or not at this step. And everything is fine. Last step, stabilizer for 30 to 60 seconds. I don't know what I should be expecting, but these results are a little bit underwhelming.
Yeah, I'm not happy with the result. Nothing is sharp. I have to try again. I got no more stainless steel 800T, so I'm using Portrait 800 this time. Along with my big tripod and shutter release cable. For some reason, I forgot to wind film, so I have my first shot double exposed. Well, this row is still all soft focus. Might be the lens or the body then. This is a 50 year old camera after all, and I don't think it has ever been serviced. Anyway, this is a comparison between Cinesteel 800T and a Kodak Portrait 800, and these are my favorite shots. Next video will be about painting again. I only occasionally share some film photography videos. Hope you enjoyed it, and let's meet again in the next video. Bye!